two Armenian prisoners of war have been returned to Armenia from Azerbaijan. A plane of the Russian Airspace Forces transporting them landed at Eripuni Airport of Yerevan on Tuesday, Sputnik Armenia reported. According to the source, these servicemen are Artur Nalbantian and Aramay Storozian. The source also reported that the commander of the Russian peacekeeping contingent in Artsakh, Nagorno-Karabakh, Rustam Muradov, had gone to Azerbaijan to help them return to their homeland. A tragic incident took place Tuesday in Yerevan, Shamshan.com reported. At around 8.30 p.m., the police received a call informing that a woman's dead body was found near the train tracks in Noragavit neighborhood. The police and investigators who were dispatched to the scene found the body of Yerevan resident Kohar Khe, 43 years old. According to preliminary information, she was run over by a train several hours before the discovery of her body by the switchman who was operating this train and who, after running over this woman, had fled the scene by train, whereas he could have stopped the train and alerted the police regarding this incident. Armenian Prime Minister spokeswoman Mana Gevorkian has informed on Facebook that Prime Minister Nikol Pashinyan had arrived in Georgia on an official visit. After the official welcoming ceremony, Pashinyan and the Georgian Prime Minister Irakli Garibashvili will have a private talk, after which the talks will continue in an extended format. The PMs of the two countries will also make statements to the media summing up the results of their talks. The Armenian Prime Minister is scheduled to meet also with Georgian President Salome Zorabishvili. As of Wednesday morning, 645 new cases of the coronavirus were confirmed in Armenia and the total number of these cases has now reached 246,410 in the country. Also, 15 more deaths from COVID-19 were registered, making the respective total 4,954 cases.